So Perfect Keto has a brand new strawberry MCT oil powder, and I'm really excited about this because I like the old strawberry, you know, flavors. We just had to wait for Rachel to handle a cat issue. He was not satisfied with his uh, kibble for the day. He, he wanted had food. He wanted tuna fish though. So he um, was he was just not having it. This is what happens when your cats get a little elderly. Yes. Let's talk about strawberry Perfect Keto MCT oil powder. Hey, what's up family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, two Crazy, Crazy Ketas. Ketas. And if you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Ketas, we do different things like recipe videos and we do product reviews. We talk about various keto topics and then every Monday, when we sit down on a couch for Keto on the Couch, we just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us in different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com, and that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon, and that way, every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. So, Perfect Keto came out with a brand new flavor of MC2 oil powder, and I'm really excited about this one because they have two other strawberry things they came out with, right? They and came they out with it. this stuff, the strawberry collagen, which is Rachel's favorite. It's delicious. I think you actually like this better than peanut butter. Well, I mean, I like peanut butter too. Okay. But the strawberry really is super delicious. It reminds me of strawberry quick. Yes. Which I'll, we'll leave a link for a review up there, but that, that's what this reminds me of. And then they also came out with the strawberry lemonade base which right we don't do the base which is exogenous ketones a lot i wish we had it in utah yes because we were going and going and doing a lot of outdoor sports stuff and then trying to like maintain stamina for you know into the night when we do do base the strawberry lemonade has become my go-to because it's very refreshing it works with the salt yeah that's what it, that's why it's so refreshing because right because it mixes a, with the salt it has a real you know salty taste to it so yeah they came out with the mc2 powder so i'm really Really, really excited about this one so we're gonna go ahead and taste this now I'm not excited about putting it in the coffee though well that's where I figured so we like to put our MC2 oil powder in coffee because it's a great way to give that creaminess and the sweetness without adding a whole bunch of like you know heavy cream and, and all yeah. that kind of stuff it's also great on the road but I was thinking like strawberry, strawberry with you know coffee so we'll see what I did was I brought out a glass of milk and it's the good it's milk. It's actually this stuff. And so we did a review of this. This is the Maple Hill Zero Sugar Milk. Review up there. The one that we reviewed was the low fat. Mm -hmm. While we were in Utah, well, actually the day before we left for Utah, we had the whole milk delivered. So we have not yet even tasted the whole milk. Right. So I figured let's put this in there and see if we can duplicate strawberry quick. I'm not upset about that at all because okay. I, I loved the milk. So but let's do this. We're going to go ahead and uh, taste it first. Then we'll do our five things review. Taste that first. We're going to taste the coffee first. Okay. okay. But now here's the problem. When you get these things and they're brand new, I, I think this one is used. Yeah. Um, it's hard to get the scoop out. I almost and I don't want to make a mess. That they would make all of their containers the wide containers, because my hand is too thick. Yes. So hey, perfect keto. <laughs> if you're watching this, can we? I don't know. Maybe, maybe there's a reason. But recently they changed their college into this nice and big wide it. container. I would love to see them change this container for MC2 oil powder to this container. It's easy to get out. I actually already reached in and got the scoop out because that's we challenging. We didn't want to make a mess? Too. Yeah, I didn't want to have a mess all over the table. And, and it does. When you're fishing for the scoop, even in my laundry detergent, I have to fish for the scoop. But I will say, it's packed all the way to the top. It is. I mean, it's up there. So what we'll do is we'll do a scoop in each one. Oh, I know what we can do. Let's do a scoop in each one. Let's try the coffee right now. And then when we get to the actual- You have to wait for the milk? Why not? Oh. When we get to the taste, so now we gotta put it in like this, right? Yeah. Oh, this way at least it won't be buried. Right. right. So um, when we get to the taste, because normally we taste it now and then we come to taste and we kind of mention it, right? Okay. So let's actually taste the milk when we get to number three, Oof. but we'll taste the coffee. I don't wanna have to wait, but right okay. Right now, okay. Handy dandy stick blender. Joe's the slob. So the cup's only filled halfway, which means this Smart. is a Rachel and Joe size cup, but it's got an average Normal person's amount of coffee amount of in coffee. there. An right? appropriate I, amount of coffee. I think there's like 10 ounces of coffee in there, but the mug is like six, 18 or 20 ounces. 
These are actually my grandparents' mugs. This Are they really? These, yeah. I thought we got them from a thrift store. No, we got them. My mom had them, and I just totally hijacked them. So one of the things I love about MC20 powder is the fact that it blends so smoothly. It's like dust. It's like, it's like dust. It really works well, which is why we actually keep it in our car. It doesn't get clumpy, even our, in even our in humidity. Even in our humidity. So we, we keep it in the car because, hey, we're coffee drinkers. We go to a gas station like Wawa or something like that. And most of the time they don't have good creams. They don't have that and they don't have an unsweetened almond milk no. option either. So we keep it in the car. You can put it in your, we have our Contigo. You put a scoop of this in there, fill up with coffee, give it a shake. It blends up. But it even mixes with just those little wooden stirrers. Yes. So we really like that. Okay, now you can't have the milk. Okay, I'm going to wait. We're going coffee. Because you know this, this sounds be weird. Good. Strawberry in coffee sounds weird. Yeah, it does sound weird. I don't hate that. Weirdly, I don't hate it. It's weird. It's creamy, because that's what's really nice about Perfect Keto. It does add the cream to it. If you're like a cream in your coffee type of person, mm -hmm. you get the cream and the sweetness side, but. It's a little weird. It's weird. The strawberry comes through. The strawberry is really working hard, so yeah. It's it's combating the bitterness of the coffee, I, and that's a bitter coffee we're drinking. I don't think that I would use it in my coffee. I'd use another flavor like vanilla or mm -hmm. salted caramel. That's really good in mm -hmm. my coffee. But I didn't think coming into this, I that would want to put it in there. Okay, it's so very creamy. here's the thing. This is a very dark roast because Rachel likes I say dark, I don't like it, but roast, I keep going back. Right? That's a dark roast. I feel like in a light roast, it might really come through. I mean, again, the strawberry is overpowering a dark roast coffee. It's very nice. So I think if you if you're like a light roast, which by the way, did you know that as, as weird as this sounds, light roast has more more caffeine than dark roast. It does. Did I did know, know that? that. Yes. So, okay, let's do five things. Five then things. we'll come back to milk. So five things. So if you're new to our channel, we review all products based on five things. We're going to talk about the ingredients. Does a keto base on a nutrition label? How does it taste? How much does it cost? And finally, would we recommend it? Number one. Okay, well, we're going to have to reverse. I normally knew number one and you did number two, but no glasses. Oh. So you got number one, the I ingredients. So the ingredients are coconut cream powder. Ooh. Huh. Because I don't taste coconut no, in that. No, I don't. So that's, but that's a Man, good thing. We'll have to get to the milk. That's a good thing. Natural flavors, sea salt, gum acacia, stevia leaf extract, beet juice powder for color. Okay. I feel okay. good. Uh, those ingredients are really good. Okay. It's, it's making me be a little concerned on number two. So obviously MCT comes from coconut. Right. It's a great place to get it. That's why we have coconut powder. Yeah. Because that's going to give the MCT. But we have gum acacia, which our government has decided is no longer a fiber, but it is a fiber. As a matter of fact, it's a fiber that really helps with short-chain fatty acids. So. I have determined that you are no longer bald. Yeah. <laughs> That's what, it's a fact, but also if I say it's not, then maybe it's not. Yeah, so number two, does it keto based on a nutrition label? So, hold it out here so my eyes will focus. Um, so we have 30 scoops in a container, that's really good. Yeah. One scoop, so it'd be 30 days in a month, one scoop a, mo a day, that's pretty good. Except for the 31 day months. That's when you know to like purchase Bummer. again. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so one scoop is uh, 80 calories. It has seven grams of fat. There's no protein listed in here. Uh, and then we have four total carbohydrates. I'm fine with that. Okay. So it's, and it's all saturated fat. Yay. Okay. So here's the thing. So there's no listed fiber in here. It does have 10,000 milligrams of medium chain triglycerides. So if you... Um, are not used to MC2 start or powder, slow. start off slow, like maybe a half a scoop, because you could possibly have some bathroom pyrotechnics. It's yeah. a great way if you're like us and you're on vacation and you're like, and you have that issue, like not using the restroom, use a little bit of this stuff. TMI. So here's the thing, four total carbohydrates, since we're still on number two, it's got gum acacia, which is the third ingredient. And that's a fiber or it is a fiber, even though the government says it isn't. It really isn't a carb that your body's gonna digest. So you can remove that, but they're not listing how much is in here. I'm gonna tell you, I'm guessing, this is one to two net carbs, but we're just gonna go with it's four total it's full carbs. It's four total carbs. We don't know what the net carbs is because you can't subtract that because, or at least the government says we can't subtract it. But. Well, and I, you know, a scoop for 80 calories, sometimes that seems daunting to people, but like go put a splash of heavy whipping cream in well, your coffee. A tablespoon of butter is 100. Yeah, so you're actually saving calories if that is a concern to you. And you're adding some flavor. So mm -hmm. 
Yes, it absolutely ketos based on the nutrition label. Okay, number three. Yes. Let's, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Let's give it one more blend. It's getting really thick, which oh. I like to see. I have a feeling. Why do you get to taste it first? I have a feeling because you made me wait. I have a feeling that it is pink. It I'm, looks like strawberry quick. I'm gonna put this in a blender with ice and make it a milkshake. That's what I'm gonna do with it. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do with it. I really want to be able to like give you my <laughs> honest opinion. Well, you can give your honest opinion on one sip. Drink half of it. That is really good. <laughs> that might be better than the collagen. It is. I think it is better than collagen, honestly. And I love the collagen. You know, you know, it's you got so the, creamy. You know, you got the fat one. Like, look at the glass. Oh, that is like the real milk with the real strawberry taste. That is really good. If you if you don't want regular milk, you can mix that with almond milk. No, you could probably mix it with water. But why would you? You could make this. Couldn't this be the fat source for like a keto chow? Uh huh. Hello. We'll talk about that when we get to number five. Let's talk about number four. Okay, how much does it cost? How much does it I cost? Because that's always the problem. So if you go to their website, the price is thirty six ninety nine, oh, but we got good. some good news. Well, first of all, let's go with thirty six ninety nine. That's a okay. dollar sixty nine a serving. That is less than I'm paying for coffee at Wawa presently. Yeah, well, heck, Anthony, they just raised the price of refilling Anthony's soda. It's three dollars to refill his soda, and cup that does him. nothing for me. Right. <laughs> I think about how much that we used to spend, not just black coffee when you go to Starbucks, but when we would get the frou frou drink, right? We would get the the you know frappuccinos, and and we were five six dollars for that kind of stuff. Well, I get black coffee, and it's more than two dollars. We have a local coffee shop that's selling keto coffee, and it's four dollars and eighty five cents for a cup, it and has, it's it's not even this big. It's not. It has like a pat of butter in it, and that's it. Right. So a dollar sixty nine, fifty cents to eighty cents if you're making the coffee at home. So you're still like $2.25 for a cup of coffee that's helping you. Because again, MCTs, they're gonna help you with ketones. So yeah. yeah. Well, and also here's the thing. It is one scoop in Before milk and I'm this. done. Not like 47 components to my delicious coffee. Sometimes it's like, I like making a fun coffee at home, but it's like, I need this, a squirt of this, a pinch of this, season it with cinnamon, all this mix. This is just done yeah. and delicious. Okay. Well. Getting back to price, mm -hmm. here's the good news. $36.99 is regular price, but it's Perfect Keto. First of all, Perfect Keto is huge supporters of Two Crazy Ketos. They sponsor a couple of videos every month, at least twice a month. They give us some type of a coupon for you guys. And then even when they're not sponsoring a video, we have a coupon down below for, I don't know if it's 15 or 20% off. It's good for one, one time per email, but we almost always have some kind of a sale. Yeah. But better news is if you're watching this video when it launches, okay, if you look right now on the website, you're not even gonna find this product. Right. It, it's not releasing till next week when we're filming this video. But we have a special link, which is down below. And that link is going to allow you to purchase it a week before it's available to the general public. And I think this stuff is gonna sell out like the NOLA bars. I think it will too. Um, if you use that link, you'll find the strawberry MCT powder. Again, if you go to the website, you won't find it unless you use a link below. But you're also gonna get, buy two, get one free. Not just on this, but site-wide. Okay, that's so awesome. You could get, <laughs> you could get this, and then get this. Peanut butter Let's and jelly. Put the label out, that would be good. Half a, a scoop, half a scoop. Yeah, so use that link down below. And again, if you're watching this video later on, like not after the week that we're actually putting this up, uh, there's almost always some kind of a sale. So you should probably much never be paying $36.99 for right, it. Right, be, always be less. But again, I think $36.99 is not a bad price for it. I really don't. Way less than I'm paying to go to the gas station for my coffee. Not even a, a fancy, you know, bougie coffee yeah. shop, the gas station. Right. Is, this is less money than that. Yep. <laughs> Number five, would we recommend it? I think the answer is yes. And let's get back to what you were talking about before because yeah, so here's the thing. I'm thinking this this is a good strawberry flavor. Are you gonna finish that? Yes, I am. I oh. was trying to be nice and leave it so that people can see oh. milk, but yeah. Um, so I'm thinking this strawberry flavor is so good. How good would this be if you mix it with like a scoop of a quip strawberry protein? 
or like you said, a scoop of strawberry or any flavor keto chow. A lot of people are doing protein sparing modified fast right now. So you could mix a scoop of this with a scoop of Equip with a scoop of keto chow. You're up somewhere and then add in the good milk, eight ounces of that. You're looking at like over 50 grams of protein with like 15 grams of fat, that's perfect for a protein sparing modified fast. It's a perfect amount of fat. Now I would not use more than a scoop of this or yeah, bathroom pyrotechnics. Run for the bathroom. But yeah, ketones, everything about it, good. Well, and I like the fact we could do it, we could make the keto chow camping, mm -hmm. you know, where if you're, if you're even tent camping mm -hmm. and you're like, well, I'm, I've got enough room for some milk, but that's about it in my cooler. Yeah. You can bring this and you don't have to, you know, bring butter and melted and all that kind of stuff. It's like ready to go. Yeah, and like even when you come to base, one of the reasons that people say, how come you guys don't do the base if you want those extra ketones for the heightened energy? Cause you can accomplish the same thing with this. Yeah. So you take the base, it is gonna give you that jolt of energy. It is gonna give you some electrolytes because they're bound to electrolytes, but the jolt of energy doesn't last as long as if you get your ketones from your fat. Right. And the cool thing about MCT oil powder, are you, I hope you're ready for focus since like we're drinking this now, Yeah. Um, is it does convert right into ketones. And therefore, now you're gonna get that same reaction like from taking the base, only it lasts a couple of hours, which for right. today is gonna to be really good. I need we have it. a long day. We have a long day today, yep. and I'm excited that I'm gonna be fueled for the whole of it. Do you recommend this? I absolutely recommend this, and I'm telling you, in it's July right now. For July and August in South Florida, it is absolutely miserable. So as much as I love my hot coffee, usually I will drink iced coffee mm -hmm. going to work and stuff because it's just so hot. I don't want to add any more heat to me. Plus, I'm going through hot flashes. Okay. So I like this as an alternative even to the coffee because it's accomplishing the same thing. It's giving me a, a pep in my step for the day and it tastes delicious, but I can put this over ice and head out the door. I mean, now that you mentioned, I, I don't wanna make the video too long, but now that you mentioned iced coffee, I'll bet you this would be good in iced coffee because I think one of the reasons it's kind of weird is hot, right? Strawberry hot. It may change in an iced coffee. I don't, I don't know. Let us know down below. Have you tried that? Have you tried something like strawberry in an iced coffee? Honestly, I don't think I would ever drink it in coffee again because this is so amazing. Why would I waste the scoop of it, right. you know, in anything other than this? But that's okay. just me. Some that's people, just you. Everybody's some people love it in coffee. I'm taste sure. is subjective. It is. Let us know down in the comment section. If you get this, let us know, come back to this video and let us know if you like it. Also, you know what I'm curious? What other flavors should Perfect Keto come out with for the MCT and for the college? I mean, they have chocolate and they have vanilla, they have salted caramel, they have a matcha. We're not really into matcha, but some matcha people fan. love matcha. And uh, they have the peanut butter. Now we have strawberry, maybe grape. No, yeah. ew, no. Butterscotch. Okay, butterscotch has my attention. Grape hey though, guys, ew. Butterscotch, can we have a butterscotch MCT oil and a butterscotch collagen? That would be delicious. That would be delicious. So. That's gonna be today's video. Now, uh, if you like seeing videos like this, why don't you check out the video that we're gonna have YouTube recommend to you and you're gonna find that right down there. Also, don't forget to take a look at our most recent video, which I'm gonna put right over here. Whether you head this way or you head this way, don't forget to head this way. Subscribe to our channel and click the little bell icon and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Until next time, bye. bye.